the monsoon winds are here, cool and nice, yet we will rain. Tamil Nadu has been shy of rain for some time. <laughs> Those of you who have been through the summer here, you understand the blessing of the monsoon breeze. <laughs> so we need to understand this. The water on the planet has always been the same quantity. The question is, who will have it? Sometimes it's here, sometimes it's there, sometimes it's somewhere else. We just have to know what do we have to do to get it here? <laughs> but never has it so happened, people think the water has gone somewhere, it's not gone anywhere. It's just here, but maybe not available to us, that's the only problem. The same goes for grace, it's just like attracting rain, just like that. The grace is always there, abundantly there. The question is only, will I get it or not? <laughs> That's only the question. <laughs> the rain, the rain bearing clouds, they have no discretion they are willing to shed their load anywhere. They are eager to shed as quickly as possible. But you must sit here and watch whether they will shed it here or they will pass us and shed it somewhere else. This means we are doing something wrong. This means we do not know how to draw the rain <laughs> because we are little English educated and we've been singing, rain, rain, go away <laughs> This happened. This is actually happening, this is a fact. <laughs> the Japanese <laughs> Anybody here? No, only Chinese. No Japanese. The Japanese people eat much less fat than the Americans and the British. Because of this, people believe they have much less incidence of cardiac arrest. Less people in Japan die of heart failures and heart attacks than they do in UK and in United States. But the French eat lot more fat, but still they have much less incidence of cardiac problems compared to the British and the Americans. The Japanese people don't drink much wine, so they have much less cardiac problems. But the Italians, drink only wine. And they also have much less cardiac problems than the English and the Americans. So the deduction is, it is the English language which is the problem <laughs> The English speaking which is the problem. So this has been a problem everywhere that we try to transplant what is happening in one place simply as it is in another place. Not just geographically and culturally, even from individual to individual. That what worked for one person, we try to make it work for another person and destroy that person completely. <laughs> Unfortunately, this is labeled as education, mass-producing people. Do 
though we are a mass of people on this planet, a huge number, over seven billion people, still you were produced individually, not mass produced, are you? Right from my childhood, I've been noticing this, that most adults want to teach something when they see children. All those damn things which have not worked in their life. <laughs> this is one vow you have to take with me, that is, from this moment onwards in your life, you will not pass on anything that has not worked for you to anybody else. Hello? Yes. Even if you cannot pass on the best things to other people, at least what has not worked for you, you don't give it to anybody. Will you do this? Yes. Does anger work for you? So don't give it to anybody. <laughs> Does misery work for you? Does depression work for you? So, if you are angry, if you are depressed, you are miserable, just shut up, <laughs> okay? And sit in one place and handle it. But the miserable people are the ones who are always talking and sharing. When they are joyful, they may not talk so much. When they are miserable, they talk a lot. Will you take care of this, that what is not working for you, you will not give it to anybody? Huh? This much, this much sense we have, this much sense we must have. If you do not have the best things, doesn't matter. At least what doesn't work, don't pass it on. Let it die with you. Huh? I would like you also to be blissed out, but you want to die miserably, it's up to you. But at least don't infect the world, hmm? Yes? So, this much care everybody must take. Stupid things that don't work for you are happening within you, you must just shut up. Hmm? Children also? Yes? If something is working wonderfully for you, then please chirp. See, even the birds know this. They all start tweeting only when they are very happy. <laughs> when they are miserable, they simply sit quietly. <laughs>